Hey guys, today I am going to be doing a video on holiday gift ideas for girls and I think the last time I did one of these videos was about two years ago and since it is snowing outside I think it was a great day to kick off my holiday videos because 10 inches you can't really go outside so you gotta be stuck inside so I decided to film this video for you guys so this video is gonna be a bunch of random gifts ideas for girls most of it's gonna be beauty stuff since I do do beauty videos so I'm just thinking about stuff that I would want for Christmas and it's giving it to you guys as ideas I guess um, so the first thing I am going to suggest is a subscription box and there's a whole bunch of different ones on the web there's food boxes there's period boxes there's what else is there there's some random subscription boxes out there but the one I suggest for like myself and like other people that love makeup and stuff is definitely beauty subscription boxes there's Ipsy uh, Birchbox BoxyCharm and BeautyCon box. I've never tried Ipsy or uh, Birchbox. I don't know, for the price, I don't really know. I know Ipsy is $10 a month and it's really hard to get on that list. But with BoxyCharm and BeautyCon uh, BFF box, the BoxyCharm box is $21 a month. Get them just maybe a month of subscription boxes or get them the whole year of subscription boxes. It's totally up to you depending on the money that you want to spend. And then I really don't know how much the Beautycon BFF box is. I got mine when I was in Beautycon in New York City. So they definitely depend on what you want to get them as a gift. I just think that they're really cool. They come with a lot of different stuff with beauty products, makeup, coupons, just a lot of different stuff that you can get, even random subscription boxes. I mean, for the price, you can't beat it because if you really don't know what to get them, just say, like, oh, yeah, your box is coming in the mail. Oh, did you get my gift? Especially if you live out of town and you can't go visit that person for Christmas, just send them a box and say, oh, hey, I sent you your Christmas present and be coming in the mail in a couple days. And there they go. They got their box. And the next thing I'm going to be talking about to get a girl for Christmas is definitely a hair products and like a, maybe a straightener. And this is just a Remington, this is just a Remington T-Studio Protect Styling Straightener. And it just doesn't really matter what straightener or curling iron you get. But just getting them hair products in general is a great idea because like giving them little like stuff like this, like Garnier Fructis hairspray and leave-in conditioner, like that's great, especially if you had know someone that likes to dye their hair a lot, like me, obviously, because I was just blonde maybe a couple weeks ago. No, I have dark hair again. But like dyeing their hair, leave-in conditioner is great, just hairspray, anything like that. Um so any hair products in general is a great idea for girls. And another great idea for girls that love makeup and hair and doing stuff like that is definitely this little nail clutch. And I think this is a super cute idea. I never would have thought about this. I don't know how many people have nail polishes just like stuck in a bin in their house because I have a whole bin filled nail polishes and it's so horrible to go through that and look through it all and like throw them all on the floor and then you basically have one open and it spills everywhere. Just such a hassle. Like I really regret buying nail polishes now because I have no place to put them. This case right here is amazing. It stores 18 nail polishes. It's just this clear case and you just, it has like a little metal or a magnet thing and it's clear and you can just see how many different brands fit in here. I got LA Girl, uh, Revlon, some knockoff brands, um, Wet n Wild, NYC, just some OPI. I got a bunch of different nail polishes. They all fit in here so well. And it doesn't take up many room. It takes up like as much room as a book would if you had a book in your room. And you just slide it on a shelf, lay it down, and it's just a super cute idea. This is runs for about $29.99. But this is a like super cute idea for get to get someone to organize if you know someone's going to college or going away, have their own apartment. That's a great way. Or even for girls that just need a little bit more organization. And also with the color clutch, they also sell these little traveling cases as well where you can stick eight nail polishes in here and have them on the go. And especially if you know someone that likes to travel. This is I think is twenty dollars. Not really sure exactly how much of the price is. But they come in this color right here, which they're both the robin's egg. And then they have another color, which I think is like a purple shade. 
So you can definitely check online. So a link down below will be for adding on to that. You can get them a bunch of different nail polishes. And with this, you can get them this with it like stuck with nail polishes. So they get it, they already have nail polishes in it. So like getting them like little Etsy nail polishes, like they're stuck together because there's glue on them. Getting them little Etsy nail polishes or wet and wild and throwing that up, that makes a great gift right there. And you didn't pay that much and it looks awesome and who doesn't want 18 nail polishes and a container to store it? I don't know. And another great thing to get a girl is just makeup in general, any kind of makeup kits or storage is just a great idea for anybody. If you don't know, like, you see like a little makeup palette that's on sale, just get in, set it off for Christmas, go to Ulta, get the little, um, was it, $19.99 pack of makeup from Ulta. Not a bad deal at all. And if you're looking for someone that loves music, get them like an iTunes gift card or get them some headphones like Beats or something like that. Great ideas. Get them their favorite album. Get them concert tickets. It's a really great idea. And if you have the person that likes to read a lot, make sure you get them like a book or a magazine subscription because magazine subscriptions are a great idea because I love my Seventeen magazine subscription and my Teen Vogue subscription. I think I paid $23 for both of them. For three years for Seventeen and two years for Teen Vogue, I don't get them anymore because I don't have time to read. But yeah, but anyways, the last thing that I want to like get out there is just if you don't really know what to get them, I personally love gift cards and money because I could personally pick out my own gifts and you don't have that awkward moment of sitting there at Christmas opening something and then feeling really awkward because that's not something you personally like because you're like okay I don't really know what to do with this I never said I like video games or something like that it's just like you have to sit there but if you really just don't know if any of these ideas work for that person gift cards are fine getting them American Express gift card getting them their favorite store gift card. I think the best way to go, to be honest, is just a general gift card, which is just like a Visa gift card or American Express gift card because they can go to whatever store they want to and use it and buy food. Or you can just get them a Chipotle gift card or just whatever you feel like getting them if you know that them the best. Or just cash in general. And just, I think a lot of people like that more because they can pick out their old things and they just say thank you and, you know, no awkwardness there. But yeah, that pretty much finishes off my gift idea video. This was like a lot of things, but not as much things. If you guys want me to do another video on it, I will do so. And I will also have a link down below on the video I did two years ago, because I might have some more ideas in there as well. And if you guys like this video, make sure you guys give it a big thumbs up. And also subscribe to me as well. I just hit 100,000 subscribers, so I'm very excited. And thank you guys for that. And make sure you guys go check out my Instagram and Twitter page at CJWalker735 for both. And add me on Snapchat at CGWalker735 as well. Make sure you guys go subscribe to my vlog channel because I'm going to start daily vlogging and vlogmas very soon. Because, oh my god, vlogmas is starting soon. Oh, I didn't think about that. I guess I'm going to be vlogging every single day. If you have some video requests, make sure you guys leave them down below because I want to know what you guys want to see for the holidays. And yeah, so that pretty much finishes off this video. I will see you guys real soon. Bye.